à tous de DDO, attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, top Allumage Vulcain. Allumage de EAP, décollage. nominale la trajectoire est nominale engines a lot of fire and with a bepi colombo on board the ddo says all is well the two boosters now providing 90 that's 90 percent of our thrust propelling the launcher along her trajectory at an ever higher velocity 780 780 tons at liftoff that's the mass and to get that sort of mass off the ground, need a lot of push and push we have she's burning five tons of fuel every second Two and a half tons being burned every second in each booster, plus the core stage burning another 300 kilos of fuel every second. Ariane 5 putting on quite a show. And I uh, can't wait for Ioannis to come back and tell us his reactions. The sky is clear. You should be able to see separation of the boosters, maybe even separation of the fairing. We'll find out momentarily. Ariane 5 now following the program and the onboard computer, which gives all the orders, including stage separation. We'll soon see that in just about uh, 30 seconds from now. We are in the first of four flight phases. The first three are powered, and we'll describe each in turn so you can follow. Right now, the first flight phase, the single first stage engine, and the two boosters are burning. The boosters will each consume their 240 tons in just over two minutes, in just about 10 seconds. They will be the first to be extinguished, and you'll hear that from the DDO, but you'll see that on the screen. You'll see the flame out there. Like. There it is. You see, you see the main point of light in the middle when we come back to that, and the two points of light on, e on either side are the boosters. That's what it looks like up there. There's another booster on the port side, of course, out of camera range. But you see the main point of light looks like the moon in the middle and on the side the two boosters flaming out and they will fall into the Atlantic. French Guiana in part chosen as a base for its opening on the ocean launching po launches posing no threat to the local population, of course. We're waiting for Johannes uh, to come back. Before he comes back, our next milestone separation of the fairing. That's next stuff. As we continue to follow Ariane with uh, looks like a ground uh, camera or the, or the naked eye. Separation de la the launcher making her the, the DDU has called out separation of the fairing. And uh, this is what that looks like. There's another half on the starboard side, which is falling uh, into the Atlantic as well. We can separate the fairing now. Why? Because we're out of the dense layers of the atmosphere, of course. Over 100 meters altitude. And you can see on the bottom of your screen, on the left, our altitude, 140 kilometers. And on the right, our speed, 2.4 kilometers per second.